I don't know how it's gonna come out, just like with all the episodes. <laughs> Ooh, the oven is ready, but we are not <laughs> cut. Hold on. <laughs> well, that's a really big sheet. <laughs> you're not supposed to. You're not supposed to eat raw cookie dough. I can never not. Look at that. It's a it's a big enough cookie to feed the kingdom. So I was thinking about. Did you text me? to all of my kingdom, my people. We are baking a Halloween spider cookie, spider web cookie today. So I'm really excited because I got to wear my Spartan Queen outfit today. Um, there was some controversy over the outfit because they said, well, you're actually, uh, what's, what's that, not a Spartan Queen. Oh, a Roman goddess. They said you're actually a Roman goddess. But then I was like, well, it's kind of like toga. And you know, fun fact, I've never been to a toga party. So this is like, in Halloween, you can be whatever you want, right? So that's my, my toga fantasy this year. So we're gonna make the spider. I saw this and I'm like, I have got to try this. I don't know how it's gonna come out, just like, with all the episodes. We don't know how it's gonna turn out, but we're gonna try it. So what we need is a ginormous 16 inch pizza pan. But it could be a cookie pan. I think too. you might've went a little too big. <laughs> I know, he's like, well, why don't you get this one? But it, I think the bigger, the better. You want it, like, let's see how this goes. I don't know how it's gonna bake. Maybe I should have got the 14 inch, we'll see. But any, in any event, I want to make a pizza this weekend too, a homemade pizza, so I wanted it. And then you get two of the tube of cookie dough. So I got the Nestle, Nestle Toll House cookie dough tubes, chocolate chip. But I'm sure you can do, if you want to do a sugar cookie or M&M, whatever you like. And then you need the cookie black icing for the, make the web. And then some frosting that after the cookie cools, we're gonna put the vanilla white frosting on it. Because we'll have those white. We're gonna take the grease pan, which this time I made sure I didn't spray the floor so I don't slip and fall. And I don't have Heels on. Tip. Ooh, the oven is ready, but we are not. <laughs> so we're going to start to cut these and place them on the 16 inch pan. Now one tip that I was reading about is you don't want to put too much dough Although we're okay with this one, there were some pans that didn't have the edges and then the cookie dough went over. You gotta watch. That's a backseat cooker right there. I am the queen for today. For today. And tomorrow. <laughs> Whoa. You know what? I think I'm gonna need a few more. We have to open the second one. I wasn't sure. So. Careful. Okay. There's a little tip, there's like a sliver. Okay. We might need more. We're gonna see how. You know what? I feel like. Need one more. That's how it 
this with cooking and baking. You just sometimes have to go along with what you might need. Uh, sometimes even the oven needs to be up, up in degrees or down in degrees because every oven's different. So you kind of just have to go with, even though, so now we're going to, I know, I'm gonna need more people of the kingdom. Smash this cookie dough. You don't wanna smash it too thin. I'm, a, I'm assuming, I'm assuming people of the kingdom. So I've never been to a toga party and it got me to thinking like all the things that I haven't done in my life and that it just shows you how much you can do in life like there's so many things I still want to do um well that's a really big sheet I tried to help you. It's, it's, you know when you order a pizza, it's like a, it's like an extra, extra large. Um, so I started thinking about all the things that I haven't done in my life that I want to do. And one of them is I've never gone skiing. So that's on my like queen bucket list. So there's so many things I was thinking of like, you know, I've never gone like skydiving. I'm not sure I want to do that though. That is the biggest cookie I've ever seen in my life. Look at that, as we just keep adding more dough. You're not supposed to, you're not supposed to eat raw cookie dough. I can never not, but I only do a little bit. But like, how do you not? That's one thing that I've done in my life is eat cookie dough. Okay. So now I think the, the oven is ready, so we're gonna bake this. I'm gonna go with 350 at, I'm gonna check it at 20 minutes, or wait, 15 to 20, and we'll see where we're at. Look at that. It's a, it's a big enough cookie to feed the kingdom. <laughs> big, giant kingdom cookie is now going in the oven. this. Voila. Look at that giant, giant kingdom cookie. And now we're going to turn it into a spider web cookie for Halloween. Oh, I love the smell. Mmm. I'm not a big baker, but when I bake, mmm, I love the smells. So hopefully it's the patience where we're trying to let the cookie cool down as much as possible because when you frost something, it's really important. But we're gonna go for it. So I'm gonna frost. Get a whole bunch on here. So I'm gonna frost. We were debating whether we were gonna frost the cookie or just put the black lines for the web. frost because it's like calming that's why I like cooking you don't have to be good at it either to just enjoy it a lot of times I'll cook and I'll play my favorite music well while I'm cooking <laughs> oh it's coming out pretty good I was worried because the cookie wasn't this cool Looks yummy. Yeah, Kate, it's coming out really good. And I wasn't sure I didn't have like I I like this wooden um, spatula for frosting. And it doesn't have to be perfect because again, it's a spider web. So I was thinking about. Did you text me? 
I was thinking about a spider web and the lines of how to do it. So just remember one cross, so one, one, two, three, four. So you're gonna need four lines. We're not at the Art Institute of Pittsburgh right now. That's where uh, Kevin went to college. So I always get nervous when I do something creative. That we have the peanut gallery. But spider webs, when they spin, aren't perfect. You do know I went to school for commercial art and not culinary. So, okay, so I think when a spider spins a web, it's going to start like right here, not at the end. Whoa, people, I am steady. The queen is steady. Looks good. Thanks, bud. Let me just keep going in. Oops. So, do, do you feel like, no, let's, let, let's, you know what, let's go with it. And now, if we have some Halloween sprinkles, we can decorate it some in the area. There's little eyes in here, too. Googly eyes. Googly eyes. This is so, so cute. A little bit in the middle. A little eye in the middle. And then what you can do, I don't know where my tarantulas went, but you can put, you can even place like little spiders on your spider web cookie. <gasps> I really am proud of this one. The queen has ruled the spider web giant cookie. Happy Halloween. I hope you enjoyed my spider web cookie, and I'll see you guys next time.